Costume Designers Guild. My name is Courtney Lindbergh, and I have been a pro photographer for over two decades now in the city of Los Angeles and beyond. I am here with you today to give you some tips and tricks on how to master a red carpet experience. Today, we're gonna talk about how to enter the red carpet, different poses that will help you feel more confident showing off your fabulous look, how to hit your marks with grace and ease while letting your unique personality shine through, and lastly, how to exit the red carpet knowing you nailed it. Once you arrive at the top of the carpet, you will likely meet the red carpet publicity team or a member of the production staff that will be the gatekeeper to the carpet. They will ask you for your name and make sure it is correct on the card they have for you. You may be accompanied by your publicist or one will be provided to you. Be sure to pass off any personal items that you do not want in the photos, like your handbag or cell phone to the carpet escort, publicist, or to your date. People may be telling you to hurry up and wait or rushing you through, but I want you to always remember that you lead the timing. So take some breaths and keep your feet planted. This is a great time for you to breathe deep and do any final tugs or fluffs of your attire so you feel ready to hit the carpet when you are announced. Once your name is announced and your card is shown to the cameras, it's your turn to walk and shine. Depending on how long the carpet is, you will see multiple marks on the ground for you to stop and hit a pose. So now let's chat about some fabulous poses that will really show off what you are wearing. I recommend walking with your eyes looking down to your first spot. When your feet get to that spot, take another breath, smile, and turn your body to the cameras. This turn is where the fun begins. It's your opportunity to look out and take in the awe of the experience. Keep your feet planted, keep your chin down so your eyes pop, and lean the upper half of your body just a little bit forward. This is super flattering and will keep the emphasis on your eyes. You can slowly shift your shoulders and hips from one side to the other, all while smiling and scanning the patch of photographers directly in front of your mark. Here are some great ways to scan and pose. If your outfit has a flair or special effect, now is the time to reveal it. If it is a one-time special effect, save that for the center mark of the carpet. You may hear calls asking for you to do something like, turn around, show the back of your outfit. Feel free to indulge these requests if you feel comfortable doing so. If you hear anything you do not want to do, please feel free to simply ignore the request. Once you have slowly scanned the photographers, it is time to move to your next mark. Turn profile, let your eyes find the mark and slowly walk to it. Again, take a deep breath, pull your shoulders up and back and turn your shoulders to the camera to start your scan. You will continue to do this for all of the marks on the carpet. Each time you hit your mark and turn your shoulders to the camera is a new chance to show off your style and personality. It is important to remember the photographers behind all those cameras are rooting for you. They all want to catch that perfect shot of you being quintessentially you. Take the time, take a deep breath on each mark and recenter before you turn and let them see you sparkle. I can't emphasize enough that being comfortable in your outfit and shoes is imperative. If you have a chance, practice in it. Make sure you walk on all kinds of different textures with your shoes you'll be wearing and that they are second nature to you. Once you hit your last mark, you can call out a thank you or a wave. Once again, turn profile and you will see someone on the end cap of the carpet to help guide you to your next location. If you need help with your outfit, make sure that you have someone from your team ready on the end cap to greet and help you. Then pat yourself on the back because you just rocked a red carpet. Good for you.